What is up guys? I am Crimson May and welcome to Let's Play Banjo Kazooie. This is my first Let's Play ever, so cut me some slack if it's uh not the best thing ever. Hopefully I can do okay. But uh if you don't know this game from the glorious age that was the 90s, it was a platforming game for the Nintendo 64. It was probably my favorite game of all time, which is why I decided to do my first Let's Play ever on it. And I'm just starting it today. I have honestly played this game so many times I've lost track of how many times I've beaten it. But it's a great game. It's kind of stupidly simple, but that's not a bad thing. So hopefully you enjoy it and I can be of some entertainment to you guys. Probably won't talk too much during cutscenes, but then again, cutscenes in this game weren't very, uh, voice acting. It was just kind of grunts and noises. You give me, like, a reading voice. That'd be cool. Bitch ain't happy. Prettier than me. Yeah. Because, you know, great skin is really in right now. That's not very nice. There's no reason to hit the cauldron. He didn't do anything wrong. That broom has the stupidest face. So likely what I'm going to do is I'm going to record episodes at a time. Just uh, probably get through a world at a time during it. Like right now I'm going to get through the first level and then I'm going to get through the... Well, I guess the intro level and then the first level. Probably record a couple at a time. I think I said that already. I'm going to repeat myself so much. I love this music. It's been my favorite music ever since I was a kid. Why would you build your home so close to a witch's house anyways? How'd they even get to this little valley? There's like no way in or out. Is that your brother? I never realized that. Why'd you ask that question? Why would her brother be a girl and a witch and this you all live in this area you don't know exactly who they are like <coughs> what's the story of kazooie being in that backpack never fully think they explained that i want like another banjo game like an origin story. How Banjo met Kazooie. I also want Banjo and Kazooie to be in Smash already. It's been long enough. I've waited years. You will hate that laugh by the end of this game. Uh, Alright, we're in the game now, finally. Ooh. Oh, that's right, I don't have my abilities. I'm gonna skip uh, listening to bottles tell me how to do everything. Well, at least the part where he's gonna make me go around learning everything. This guy lives right outside your house. You never met him before? It just seems strange to me. Like, Banjo never wanders outside of his house? What? There's things I never questioned before when I played this game. Now I'm playing a Let's Play of it. I want to kind of think about it a little more. I probably shouldn't put too much logic in it. It is a 1990s game. Eventually, I do want to do more uh, 
I guess we'll say modern games. And hopefully that'll be different. Though I don't know how good I'm be at this. It's mostly doing this in my free time. And it's still not completely easy for me to keep talking to this microphone like there's someone here. Just gonna look at the microphone, maybe that'll make it better. No, it's not helping. One day I'll put my video camera on. Uh, oh, I must have missed something. Oops. Press A to learn my moves, or B to start with my- just give, give, give me all the moves. Give me all the moves. Press the button like three times. <coughs> the top of Spiral Mountain. Oh, you guys really thought hard with that naming process. Ooh. Alright, cool. The giant carrot. Why do they make the honey sound like that? I guess it works. It does sound kind of honey-ish. I, I kind of like how Banjo does not question the fact that everything in his world has eyes. Doesn't seem a little awkward. Like even the toilets have eyes. That's just that's just wrong. Extra lives. Oh, I'm glad they took that out in Banjo Tooie. Maybe I'll do a let's play that one. I'm not as good at Banjo Tooie. I, I only uh, I don't think I've ever fully completed that one. I mean, I've beaten it, but I never fully completed it. Maybe I'll do that for a let's play. I'll just 100% Banjo Tooie. I did play also Nuts and Bolts. For any of you that has not heard of that one, it was a uh, game on the Xbox, the uh, 360, and. It was alright, it was just they went away from this kind of platforming adventure game style to uh, a building style, like with vehicles and things, which was not what people were waiting for, but it, it turned out to be a pretty good game. Just gotta collect all these honeycombs to get my extra life. Uh, nope. It's gonna be in the last one I check, isn't it? Oh, motherfucker. Alright, there we go. I got it. We're good. Oh, wait, no, one more. That's right. Over here. I think it's like there's like some kind of the fuck is it like a I think it's called cauliflower I don't know I'm not a farmer Ooh. so as you can see six honeycombs grants you a bonus life so if you play this game on your free time on an emulator I would highly suggest getting those honeycombs <laughs> or you're gonna have a bad time well you won't but yeah you know you will you will I lied I'm sorry I'm a liar compulsive lying disorder uh, it's so hard to walk when I don't have the talent trot. Maybe the way is through that giant bridge in your face, leading to the giant witch's face. She is narcissistic. I think about it, like, she's got all this shit of her face inside of her house. Home. Lair. Lair. We're gonna call it a lair. I think it is called Gruntilda's Lair anyway, so that makes sense. Sister Tootie. Tootie? Was it Tootie? Or is that someone else? Uh-oh. Can't remember. It's been too long. Oh, yeah, it's Tootie. There we go. Oh, yeah, it is a lair. Yeah. Her rhyming is so annoying. I'm confused why they wait so long. Because whenever you die, they instantly... I guess if you die, they wait for the power to go long enough. See? Look at Narcissistic. Right there. Boom. Picture of herself. Bitch needs a hobby. That's not torturing little bears. Mr. Jiggy. Still one of the best games. All the jingles. Uh, can't wait to get the talent trot. Not freaking slow as hell. Ooh. 
Gotta watch my camera angles. How do I do this? A button? Was it A button? No. Oh wait, no, I have to listen to this fucking goggle freak. See? Goggle boy. Thank you, Kazooie. Hello, Kazooie. Smart ass. It's my inspiration for life. Uh, thank you. It's the only bad part when you've beaten this game so many times. Listening to them over and over and over again. So here we go, the first level. I feel really bad for the person who had to come up with all these rhymes for the witch. Alright. So as you can see, the game's not very uh, complicated when it comes to levels. Kinda just simple. Collecting all this junk. It's like a split second I know I can jump after, but... Nope, can't do it. Oh well, I tried. Going this way then. Hit this stupid ugly mug. For sake of time, I'm not going to get those notes down there. I am going to try to get every single note and everything. Go for a 100% completion as I do this. Don't know how frequently I can upload, but like I said, I'm going to be recording these in bulks if I can, when I can. So, hopefully I don't wait too long between uploads. Let's go over here and get the eggs first. Come here, you stupid monkey. Bam. Oh, nope, nope. Ah, there we go. Alright, let's take his orange real quick. Alright, and over here. And boom. Such strange things you had to do in this game to get jiggies. Nice part is I only have to listen to this on the first level. So yeah, 10 jiggies in each level. I believe it's two honeycombs. And then there's one more thing. What the hell is this you have to collect? Jiggies, honeycomb, oh, gingos. Gingos. Five gingos. That's right. But you have to collect the notes all over from the start again if you don't uh, get them the first time around. They fixed that in the 360 version, though, which was nice. Fat Baron Bird. That's very rude. Either one called him gay or just obese. Well, either one. It's not, it's not nice. Let's go over here, go over here. I shouldn't have came over here, actually. I should have thought about it. I had to go, not to come back here later. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Where's... There you are. Ancient ways of the egg. That's not nice. <coughs> Sorry for my cough. I've been a little under the weather lately. It's been a little bit difficult to... Uh, get things done like that. Oh, lovely. Hundred eggs. How does she have room for a hundred eggs in that backpack? Looks like she barely has room for her. Good lord. Tech speed increase was not a thing back then. Alright, let's get this monkey. What's up, bro? Oh, okay. Damn. I'm trying to make sure I keep focusing on talking while I'm also playing. That is definitely something that I used to. I've been streaming a bit, so oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, okay. Banjo, banjo. There we go. Mm. Make me look bad, banjo. You make me look real bad. 
This is gonna be on the internet. People are gonna see this and uh, uh, rude, rude, rude. Can you not? Can you? Can you? Would you kindly stop? Thank you. Yeah, I beat you. Now give me my prize. All right, cool. So we're gonna go this way, this way. Bop. Gotta collect this stuff first. These are needed for. Uh, well, you'll see in a bit. I have to go. That's gonna be towards the end of this level. It's just like the most random thing ever. Bear and a bird. There is one game I'm definitely going to do a let's play of when it comes out. Uh, is I guess the spiritual successor to this game. Uh, it's called Ukulele. <coughs> it seems to be starring a bat and a chameleon. I don't know, but it looks very similar to Banjo, and I'm all over that. Even the music makes me feel like I'm playing Banjo again. Get the hell out of my face, you stupid termite, I think they were? I thought they were ants when I was a kid, but apparently they're termites. So, that's a thing. Yes, the Talon Trot. Give it to me. Give it to me, you bottle-nosed freak. Come on. Z left, Z left, Z left. Move around. Ba 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 ba. Go practice. I'll do what I want. Your energy is low. Is it? I didn't even pay attention. I wasn't even low. Whatever. Oh, this is gonna make my life so much easier and shorten the time of the videos. Cause this is just. As, yeah, as you can see, I just know where everything fucking is in this game. Because I've played so many times. I've literally must have beaten this game over ten times, probably. It's ridiculous. But it's just such a fun game for me. Don't know why. Ginger. Freaking love the gingos. Alright, there's one more. Where is he? Oh, he's over there. Okay, so I can go with him later. Get me. And, oh, come on. Come on. There we go. There we go. It's actually very uncomfortable holding the trigger this long. Alright, it's just the position I have my arm in. Get me, get me, get me. Alright, there we go. Sorry for the sudden camera changes. I just uh, have to adjust it to uh, see where the hell I'm going sometimes. Nope. Alright, I need to get the beak buster. Get that. Damn, thank you. Grab you. Grab you. You think at this point I just learned to speedrun this game? Maybe I'll do that one day. I was thinking about doing that. Do a speedrun on a stream. I need to learn some speedrun tricks for Banjo, though. I don't know any. <coughs> beak buster. I think, honestly, in the second game, I like the person you learn the moves for him the most. His name is Jam Jars. He's this guy's brother. But he's like a military dude, so like every single move you learn has this little military jingle to it. Nothing more I can teach you. Thank God I don't have to listen to you anymore. Your stupid goggles. Alright, there we go. Um, like, honestly, this was like. This is probably my favorite time in gaming. I mean, I love new games. There, a lot of them are really good, especially like games like The Last of Us and things like that. Oh my god. But, uh, like, back then, I feel like every game that came out was just really nice and really good. It was just a lot of fun to play. Super Mario 64, Pokemon Puzzle League, games like those. That I just freaking love. Uh, 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 uh. No, no, nah, nah. But those games are just some of my favorite games to play back in the day. Played so much Pokemon Puzzle League ridiculous i still have my 64 actually fully intact and working my place in that later just because i'm playing this but unfortunately there's no video capturing software for 64 that i know of other than a camera and i don't have a camera that could do that so yeah this is what we're sticking with all right you oh, wait that's the wrong button mm -hmm, mm -hmm. cool story that's it oh, 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 oh. Oh, why is it Come on. Bop. Bop. Oh, come. Mm. Alright, alright. 
Hold on. Before I forget. Because when I first played this game, I forgot to grab this one when I did this. And can never get it. And it just sat there taunting me the entire time. It was so annoying. Alright, so as you can see, we're almost done with this level. I don't know how long I've been recording for because I can't see the time on my thing. But... Eventually the levels will get longer and so will the episodes. And if I get through levels quick enough, I might compact them into one episode. But for now, I'm going to see. I guess I'll have to see if people actually end up watching it and liking it. Or if not, then maybe I'll switch on to something else. Like I said, I will play some more modern games after a bit. And oh wait, where am I going? This way first, this way first. I think I have to go in here, grab a token. Has it been that long since I played Banjo? That I need to remember. Yeah, there it is. Get me you. Oh, nope. Why did I think those are ants? Why? Oh, I'm looking at them like they're freaking pink. I ain't never seen a pink ant in my life. I've seen red ants. Pink ants be weird. I would assume that thing's poisonous if it was pink. Oop. Oop. Oh, no, 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 no. Cooperate with me, Banjo. Bam. It, oh, that's another thing that's in every single area. Um, there are jiggies in Grunty's lair as well that you need to get. And to get those, you need to activate the Grunty switches in the levels. So, that's another thing that I need to get in every level. And now that I think about it, I know where a lot of them are, but I don't think I know where every single one of them is. Clearly it's been too long, so I did a full playthrough of this game. Not cracking a lot of jokes right now. It's probably because it's my first one, and I'm just like, oh god damn it! Yeah, yeah, best shaman in all game, breaking the fourth wall. Blah, blah, blah. Filthy feathered one. Oh, that's rude. Hut boy. The insults in this game. Shots fired by Kazooie. And Mumbo. Magic tokens. You need tokens to do anything. I just realized, what kind of shaman are you? What, what purpose does the token serve? Plenty tokens. Yeah, I got lots of tokens. Tech speed was not a thing back then. My team, Mumbo Magic, that you need tokens for. Yeah, really mighty. Okay. So, and, oh, come on. Haha, uh -huh, alright. I think I mentioned there is a hundred notes in every level. I think I mentioned that? Don't remember. I keep pressing the B button on my Xbox controller, but I switched my controller buttons around, so it's X button on the controller. Mostly because it matches the uh, old school uh, controller from the 64. The A button was, and the B button were like right next to each other. Made things a lot easier. Did they really? I, th I think they might have used this music for. Like, hey, hey, whoa, 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 whoa. Personal space. Thank you. Ain't never seen a termite with a backpack. Chill out. Ah, notes. Sweet. Gimme, give gimme, give gimme, give gimme. Alright, up we go. And I know where the last six are. They are underwater, which I said I was going to get later, because it's just easier with the termite. Oh, come on. I keep talking, and I'm not paying attention to exactly what I'm doing or where I'm going. Yeah, there we go. Okay. I'm going to get, like, randomly quiet every time I have to make a jump. Ah, get get away. Get, get. No, 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 no. Alright, up here. Bup, bup. And pop. Extra life. One thing that bugs me is the extra lives don't stay between playthroughs. Like, if I was to stop and, uh, freaking go, like, come back to the game, it wouldn't save it. Alright. Turn right. And over here. Because apparently this termite has infinite breathing powers, which is kind of useful. I didn't think people would do this. Alright, 100 notes, all the Jinjos, everything's done. Now we're out of here. And the reason I did the termite will be very clear right now. 
you have to leave in the termite form if you're watching this. Because if you don't, then you can't get this one. Grunty magic stops you taking the notes off the world, but the hunter you just collected counts as your best note score. Okay. 100 on each world. You see, this is something you should have told me when I got into the world. Not now. Oh, can I? There we go. Come on, come on. There we go. So, as you can see, that's why you needed that. So, this is where I'm going to end this episode. And then the next one, I will continue on to uh, the next level. So, thanks for watching, guys, if you have been sticking with me the whole time. And if you want to see more of this, press like. Hit that subscribe button if you want to see more videos.